and welcome back to our video tutorial on HTML. Uh, in this video tutorial, we're going to look at HTML lists. So let us begin. Audio we'll begin by creating the HTML structure and then put here HTML list as our title. HTML list. Okay, we have two types of HTML lists. We have the ordered list and an ordered list. Uh, please, if you need to read details about this list, I've created a document about this, this list, about the HTML list, and you can find the link to download that, uh, uh, those notes uh, about this HTML list, or uh, that link is in the description, so you can simply learn more about this list. But here we're going just to practice uh, much and practicals, okay? So, we have two types of lists of so HTML, we have the ordered list, uh, ordered list is our list with numbers, and the other one is the unordered list. A list which is not numbered okay so let us begin by ordered list to write the ordered list of course you write the word ol the ol tag and then press the tab key okay i'll not do that let's say like this ol then you close this ol tag so that means ordered list ordered list so i press enter and then um, i write the list item so every or every list you must be having must be having an item so to put an item in a list, you write LOI, okay? And then you press the tab key to close for you the LOI. So maybe you're going to have many items. Let us press Ctrl Shift and D. Ctrl Shift D to duplicate lines, okay? So it means that this is a structure of a HTML list. For example, I say colors, okay? Colors. Aha, uh -huh, so I can start here putting the colors of HTML. Um, for example, we can put um, uh, red here. Okay, here you can put here green. You can put here uh, yellow, yellow, and you can put here black. And then let me put here one more, maybe um, purple. So those are HTML colors, and uh, I mean HTML lists and have uh, included in that list colors so let us open the browser and see the output and the output if you open the browser it will be like this let's say open type the output as you can see is what is a list which has been uh, labeled with numbers so that's what we call ordered list now let us look at an order list okay to look at an ordered list i'll just say i'll just say to look at the ordered list I'll just say UL. UL stands for an order list. Maybe I should put here maybe another H2 and say these are brands. Brands. Brands, okay. Uh, so here I'll put what? The an order list of brands. So I'll write also LOI, list item as the tag that uh, we use to list an item in a list. So I'll have to close this tag, okay. Then I'll duplicate by pressing Ctrl Shift D. Ctrl Shift D to duplicate this tag. Okay. Then uh, I can start putting elements there. Ctrl Shift D for those only who are using Sublime Text. Uh, so we start uh, putting um, brands, maybe Nokia. Nokia. We put here maybe Samsung. 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 We put here Apple. Apple. Then you put here maybe. Mm. What else? What else? Motorola. Motorola. You put here maybe. Um, what other brand do you know? Uh, maybe like Toyota. <laughs> okay, I'm mixing them now. Uh, Toyota. What else? You can put also. Uh, maybe Coca Cola, Coca Cola. So those are the brands that we have. So we shall switch back to our what? to our browser and see the output. You can see the output is a list which is not having uh, uh, labeled with numbers. It's just an ordered list. It's not ordered. It's not having uh, numbers labeled labeling it. But for the other list, you can see it is having numbers. Uh, being uh, used as the labels for that for each element in a what in a in a list. 
now there are a few things that you can use to format this list for example this list let me put here maybe it should be h2 h2 okay so the sub key so i'll put here i can put maybe type is equal to a and you do like that type is equal to a it will use that a as the labeling of this so if it means that you should be put capital a what shall it happen it shall be using those a b c d to do what to be as the label so that's how we change the label type that's how we change the label type of a list now lastly we can still command the list by maybe saying we come here in class i mean in in uh, an order list and put the what style okay style attribute and say um and say a uh, list style list style this attribute then you can put different attribute you can say none okay none if you put none then this list style will be ignored it will not be having uh, this kind of uh, borders this kind of borders there are so many attributes that we can look at when you go deep into css but since in this course we won't concentrate on bootstrap then we shall look at more ma much more about list you uh, being implemented by bootstrap but shall not go that deep in css about lists uh, so that's the basic the basic information about css uh, html list please if you need to read more i just find the document is what is in the link or, or is on the link in the description below so i hope you're not missing the next video tutorial where we're going to look at the html forms it's going to be amazing uh, lecture and um please consider subscribing to our youtube channel if you found this video helpful to you and thank you for watching